To say the topic of police defunding has been contentious would be an understatement. A lot of it has revolved around this word and the idea that defunding police would lead to abolishing police. We are here today to begin the process of ending the Minneapolis Police Department. Yes, in Minneapolis, the city council voted to get rid of its police department altogether. But in Albuquerque, New Mexico, the mayor decided to take the idea of this and turn it into this. It's a public health approach to public safety. That's the city's mayor, Tim Keller, alongside Chief Administrative Officer Sarita Nair. Two weeks ago, they decided to take $10 million away from the police department each year and reallocate that money towards a new department made up of EMTs, social workers, and specialists so they can respond to certain calls instead. For you know, modern history, every city has just said, we will either send police or fire about restructuring institutionally how we respond. The move would take responsibility away from the police department, but the city's chief says it's a relief. We're not the experts. We go there and a lot of times our officers um, don't really know what to do. He says it would allow officers to focus more on public safety while allowing others more suited to address these calls to take over, solving issues on the side of police as well as the public. We'll be able to handle the higher priority calls and then our response time and our community engagement will, will be, there'll be more trust in the community. We want to get past responding to the symptom of the root cause, to the symptom of poverty, to the symptom of substance abuse, to the symptom of trauma, and we want to get down to that root cause and start addressing issues there. I'm Dan Grossman reporting.